My name is Matthias Obamsson and I have worked for Ala in about 15 years. Starting in production and then later on electrician and now mostly automation and continuous improvements. My name is Martin Leupold, I'm the responsible product manager for process sensors at Baumer. I'm located in Stockach and uh, we are here in Ala Falkenberg to make a great story about the flex flow usage in a dairy. Ala is one of uh, the world's biggest producers of dairy products and here in Falkenberg we are making cottage cheese, mainly for the Swedish market, but we also export to Finland, Denmark and Greece. We are making around 20,000 tons of cottage cheese every year here. The relationship uh, to Ala is uh, really, really old. We started uh, in the 1990s together to develop a new connection, a process connection. Now it calls Baumer Hygienic Connection. And when we heard uh, about the flex flow, uh, we got very interested about that. Before we installed the flex flow, we didn't really know where all the energy was consumed. But now we can monitor exactly where all the energy is consumed. Here in Falkenberg, the FlexFlow is used here, the newest uh, product from Baumer. We have now the flow technology on board. And uh, the FlexFlow sensor, you have the possibility to measure two things, temperature plus flow, flow speed. And uh, the uh, maximum temperature range is going up to 150 degrees. This is outstanding with one sensing element and uh, you can analyze your energy measurement on each point in your application. Here in Falkenberg we are using the FlexFlow, for example, to optimize our cooling machines and in our cleaning in place process. Since the first installation of the FlexFlow it has run very good, so we are installing more and more and it's really reliable. Our main target is uh, that we improve the processes uh, from the customer side and we learn from our customer how we can improve their daily work. The installation of the Baumer Flex Flow is very straightforward and simple. One big advantage that we can see is that we get both temperature and flow from the same sensor and that is making the initial investment uh, very cost effective.